When working on these vintage cars and vintage engines, it only makes sense to use the appropriate fasteners and hose clamps that actually were used on these cars. In this case, uh, 57 DeSoto uses a Corbin style single wire clamp. Uh, the Corbin clamp is actually, you know, some consider to be a better clamp than what's currently used on most cars, which is the screw type. Because as the hose gets older and shrinks, uh, the hose clamp itself can become loose. Whereas the Corbin style clamp is a spring style clamp, so as the hose or uh, gets shrinks and gets uh, worn, the clamp actually continues to tighten itself and create a good seal. There can be a little trick to getting a, a Corbin style clamp on. And the first big trick is to use the right style of uh, clamp pliers. In this case, I have a couple of them. Actually, I have a toolbox drawer full of them, always looking for a better mousetrap. And it's a simple enough deal. This one here looks like a regular plier. It has a couple of grooves cut into it. And that's depending on exactly what direction you want to put your clamp in at. And once you put the hose, the Corbin style clamp into it, you squeeze it together. Then it's got a little locking ring back here. That actually holds this squeeze together. Now I can fit that onto a hose and then squeeze and release it. And I've got, I've applied my hose clamp. So it's a great tool. It works great if you have the right tool. If you're just going to go at it and try it with a pliers or a, a vice grips, nine times out of 10, you'll end up shooting these things across the garage and you could also injure yourself. So get the right tool and it makes the job a lot easier.